Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to resolve if your game error that says the shell infrastructure has stopped working on your computer. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward tutorial, and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So we're going to begin by opening up a web browser, and you want to navigate over to google.com, and into Google you want to type in visual, C++, redistributable, packages, hit enter. One of the best results should be from the latest supported Visual C++ downloads in the link and it should say support.microsoft. So I'm going to select that. I'm going to scroll down and then you want to select either the 32-bit version which is going to show times 86 or the 64-bit version which says times 64 depending on what version of Windows you guys are running. So in my case I'm a 32-bit system so I'm going to select the times 86 version. If your version says it's not applicable for your computer, just select the other version. It means you probably downloaded the wrong one. And once it's done, I'm just going to left click on it once to run. Left click on the security notice. You want to accept the license terms and conditions and then left click on install. If you receive a user account control prompt, left click on yes. This will take a moment to run, so please be patient. Should say setup successful. Close out of here. Put close out of here as well. I would suggest now going over to the start menu, typing in MS config. Best match should come back with system configuration above desktop app. Left click on that one time. Now you want to go underneath the general tab and then select selective startup. You want to make sure load system services as well as load startup items are both check marked in here. And then once you've done that, left click on apply and then OK with to just restoring your computer and hopefully your issue has been resolved. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I do hope I was able to help you out. And as always, thank you for watching and I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.